Hey guys, Jacob Scott, Lorance product expert. And today, I'm gonna to show you guys how to connect your trolling motor remote to your Lorance Ghost. Now I'm gonna show you how to configure your trolling motor remote to connect to your Ghost. So the first thing that's really important to remember is you can only pair one remote at a time to this trolling motor, so you can't pair multiple remotes to it. So what we have to do is the first thing is we have to take our remote and put it in findable mode. So basically we do that by pressing and holding the plus and minus keys. We're gonna hold them down for about five seconds and as you see, it's gonna start flashing for us. Okay, once it starts flashing red like that, that means the remote is now discoverable. So what we have to do is come over here to our foot pedal to do the rest of the configuration. Okay, now that our remote's in pairing mode, let's go ahead and go to our foot pedal and go to the user configuration mode. This allows us to find the trolling motor remote. So the first thing we want to do is press the button two and three. We're going to press and hold those. And then you hear some beeps from the head of your trolling motor and you can see our lights are flashing. So that tells me we're ready to configure this. Okay, now I'm going to press and hold the battery key. And I'm going to hear a beep. Okay, that lets me know that we're in programming mode, as you can see the way it's flashing. So now we're trying to communicate with the remote, and as you can see, we're flashing red. Once it pairs, it's gonna start flashing green. As you can see, now that it's flashing green, I'm gonna press and hold the propeller on and off button right here. Now that we have those green flashes, we should be paired. Okay, so once we've paired the trolling motor remote, the next thing we have to do is exit the configuration mode. You can see the lights are flashing down here. So again, I press and hold the two and three buttons until I hear the beeping from the head of my trolling motor. As you can see, we're on a solid light now. So now everything is programmed and connected. Okay guys, with those quick easy steps, you can connect your trolling motor remote to your Lawrence Ghost. Don't forget if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to click on the link above to subscribe to the Lawrence YouTube channel so you can get this and other helpful tips.